Hi everyone, this is Sherry from Planning Peep and welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be a little different. As you can see, I have a completed spread already here. Um, I have some really, really exciting news for you guys and then also some not so great news. So I think I'm actually gonna start with the bad news so that we can kind of end on a high note. Um, so I filmed this spread last night and today when I went to import my videos, unfortunately something happened with my memory card and I lost all the footage that I had recorded. So that was a huge disappointment. I was super devastated because, you know, I put all this time in and then now everything's gone and you guys don't get a plan with me. So um, of course that was really frustrating, but um, unfortunately there's not really anything I can do. There's no way to recover those files. So I just thought I had to go with plan B. Um, so for today, I will be kind of going over my spread really quickly so you guys know what stickers I pulled in and how I built it anyways. Um, I know it's not quite the same thing as a plan with me, but some of you might be interested anyway. So I thought I would still do that. Um, but let's first move on to the really, really exciting news. As some of you guys might already know, um, I have been collaborating with a shop called Planner Just For You to create stickers out of my hand lettering and my brush lettering. And this has been a really, really fun project for both of us. The shop owner's name is Sophie and she's just been such a pleasure to work with. So the really exciting news is that today is the grand opening of the shop. We had coordinated so that this video would be uploading the same time as the shop opening. And we thought that would be a really fun way to kickstart it. Unfortunately, like I said, there's not gonna be a plan with me, but we decided to move forward anyway with the shop opening because it's something we had been discussing for a while um, and I just didn't want to keep putting it off. Um, so by the time that this video is uploaded and the time that you're seeing it, the shop is already open. Um, so I will leave a link down below that will take you directly to it if you're interested in checking it out. We are offering five different lettering stickers so far and each of these stickers come with two different sizes. Um, so we're just starting kind of small but definitely hoping to expand if things go well. And I'm going to really quickly introduce you guys to some of these sheets that we're offering. So the first thing here is Coffee Monday. This one was highly requested by a few of you when I um, asked you guys a few videos back to send me some of your requests. So thank you to everyone that did that. So here we have the Coffee Monday sheet in both the smaller size and the larger size. As you can see, um, the smaller size works nicely with an icon next to it, whereas the larger size kind of takes up the entire width of the Erin Condren. So it fits nicely in like a half box. The next sheet that we're offering is YouTube Binge, another one that was highly requested. And I'm sure during these quarantine times, you know, everyone's binging YouTube um, more than usual as I have been myself. Um, so on this one, as you can see, I decided not to use my brush lettering pen. So the font is a little bit more fine. I just really like how this one turned out. And again, it comes with both the smaller sized one and the larger. This next sheet might be my favorite. It's the date night one. And again, it comes with the two sizes. Um, I just really love how this one turned out. And I think it looks so much better as a sticker than when I try to write it in my planner. So I'm really thrilled about this. Um, the next one we've got is work, which is another one that many of you requested. For this one, we decided to go with two different fonts. So we have the thicker brush lettering font, but also this thinner font um, that I just used my paper mate into a gel pen to write, which is the pen that I always use for planning. So this pretty much is how it looks in my planner. And again, it comes with two different sizes. I did use both in the spread here so I can show you guys how they compare. And then the last sheet here I already showed in a previous video, but this is the workout time stickers um, in the smaller and the larger size. And I really also love how these ones came out. Um, so those are going to be the ones that we are starting off with. Um, like I said, we are planning to, or hoping to expand if everything goes well. Um, so a couple things I wanna mention before I jump into the spread. Sophie is going to be offering a grand opening sale. So there's going to be a 10% discount if you order within the first week of the shop opening. So from today until next Saturday, there is going to be a 10% off discount for any purchase that you make. So if you're interested in picking anything up, I would definitely recommend taking advantage of this sale. And like I said, Sophie has just been so awesome to work with. Um, I am receiving a portion of the proceeds. So um, by making any purchase, you will be directly supporting me as well. And you guys know, I just so, so appreciate all the love and support that you guys have shown me over the last few years that I've been on YouTube. So thank you in advance for any of you who have shown interest already and um, want to check out the shop. Um, so with that said, let's jump in really quick to my spread. I did want to show you guys how the stickers turned out in the planner, just so you can kind of see them in action. So this kit that I used this week is from Happy Sherpa Papery, and this is on vinyl paper. So I did have to use my Sharpie 
permanent marker, it did make it harder for me to write. So I actually wasn't a fan of my writing during the spread, but luckily I had my lettering stickers that helped make up for it. Um, so anyways, for the sidebar, everything came in the kit except for this grip sticker at the top. That's from Heather B. Co. On Monday, I started by using one of my large work script stickers. Let me just find that one. Um, this one is a brush lettering one from the larger sized sheet, and it worked really nicely with a little flag next to it. Um, these two icons came in the kit, and then I did some yoga. So I pulled in this yoga sticker from Sun Fun Stickers. To mark painting my nails, I pulled in this little nail polish sticker from Lemon Paper Co. And then here at the bottom, I love how this YouTube binge sticker worked out. Um, this one is the larger size, and I think it just works so perfectly on the full box to take up that space. And also, I paired it with this girl sticker from Paper Bear Co. For Tuesday, um, I did some groceries. So this grocery icon is from Paper and Milk. This is a full box from the kit, which I love. This unicorn is so cute. And then to mark another workout that day, I used the smaller workout time sticker and it fit perfectly with a flag and this um, little workout girl sticker that is also from Sun Fun Stickers. At the end of the night, I did a video chat with some friends. So I pulled in this computer sticker from Dizzy Daisy Dreams. For Wednesday, I started by using another work sticker and this is the um, thinner script one from the larger sheet. I also paired it with a Coffee Monsters Co. Emoji. Um, this Happy Eggy sticker is from Hazel Sticker and then the Yoga Girl or just Workout Girl sticker in general is from Thule Plans. Obviously, we're not really able to do an actual date night right now because everything's pretty much closed, um, but I did still want to use the date night sticker because I just love how that one turned out. So I decided to pull it in anyway. This one is in the smaller size, and as you can see, it fit nicely in a half box with an icon. Um, I just had a really nice chat with my boyfriend in the kitchen while he was making dinner that night, and it was just something that I really relished and enjoyed, so I decided to label that as date night. I figured that's the closest thing we'll get to that um, in the current times that we're in. And then the TV icon is from Nicole Hutch Designs, and then the pillow is from Dizzy Daisy Dreams, paired with the Relax sticker from Thule Plans. On Thursday, I pulled in another work sticker. I believe this one is the smaller sized work sticker in the brush lettering font. Yes, that's correct. And then it fit nicely with a computer sticker. That's from Nicole Hutch Designs. This pencil sticker is from Little Star Plans. And then um, the grocery icon, I think that shop's no longer open anymore. I did another video chat with some friends that night. So I used a computer sticker and I think that's from Paper and Milk, but I think she released those when she first opened. So I'm not sure that she still has them anymore. For Friday, I started by using a washi strip at the top and then I layered one of the thinner small work stickers right over it and I thought that was really perfect to make like a little header. Um, this girl working sticker is from a sampler so I'm not sure where that's from. And then the laptop right here is from Sticker Blush. Friday was the start of our spring break so I used the full box to mark that and then this cheering girl sticker which is so cute is from Artbox Stickers. At the very bottom, I used two icons. This one's from Sweet Bean Plans, and then this one, which I used to mark game night, is from Paper and Milk. For Saturday, I first pulled in a grocery icon from Sparkly Studio because we did get some groceries that day, and then I did a workout, so I pulled in another small workout time sticker from my script sheet, and um, this one I paired with a working out girl from Whimsical Cat Studio, and again, this works really nicely with a larger icon next to it. Um, for the end of the night, I just used this large checklist because we did game night with some friends, and we played a whole bunch of different games, and I just decided to label them that way. And then for Sunday, I started by using a sleeping mask sticker from Planning Like a Pro. I made some Dalgona coffee, which I've seen a lot of people do. It was so delicious, but I was definitely super wired afterwards because I really haven't had caffeine in a while. Um, this coffee sticker came with the kit, and then this Maru sticker is from Paper and Milk. I went on a run because I just had so much excess energy, and so I pulled in this Running Girl sticker from Sun Fun Stickers. Um, this camera is from the kit, and then this TV icon is from Happy Dia Stickers. I use that to mark that we watch Kim's Convenience, which just came out with their newest season. So um, that is it for this spread. Like I said, this kit is from Happy Sherpa Paper Wee. I really, really loved it. I thought it was so cute and would be so perfect to mark the grand opening of the Planner Just For You shop. That is pretty much it 
it for today. I'm so sorry about not having an actual plan with me for today, but um, I hope you guys can understand. And yeah, if you guys have any questions about these stickers or about the shop, um, please let me know. I'm more than happy to answer questions, but I'm also going to link um, Planner Just For You's Instagram down below so that you can directly contact Sophie if you have any questions that are more specific to the shop, because she would definitely know more than I would. Um, if any of you do end up purchasing, I can't wait to see how they look in your planners. You guys will definitely have to tag me in those photos so I can see how they turned out. So anyways, thank you guys so, so much for the support in advance. And for all of you guys who have already said such kind and encouraging words the last couple weeks when I've been um, starting to talk about the shop. And um, yeah, I can't wait to see how everything goes. Um, by the time this video is live, the shop is already open. So make sure you go and check it out while there is a grand opening sale. Um, this is probably the best time to purchase if you're interested. And yeah, with that said, I'm going to end the video here. Thank you so much again for joining me today. I will talk to you guys again next week when hopefully I will have an actual plan with me. But in the meantime, I hope you guys are all staying safe, staying home, taking care of yourselves and your loved ones. Um, and with that, I will talk to you guys next time. Bye.